Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Dr. Rajeshwar from YR PharmaTube. In the preceding video, we discussed the acidimetry and alkalimetry of non-aqueous titrations. If you did not watch the video, hit the i button on top right of this video to watch it. For the other topics of pharmaceutical analysis, click on the links given in the description below this video. In this lesson, we shall learn the preparation and standardization of 0.1 molar perchloric acid. The materials such as chemicals and apparatus required for the preparation and standardization of 0.1 molar perchloric acid include 8.5 ml of perchloric acid, 1 liter or 1000 ml of glacial acetic acid and 30 ml of acetic anhydride. Glassware required are 50 ml burette, burette stand, 250 ml conical flask, 50 ml pipette, 250 ml beaker, 1000 ml volumetric flask, funnel, glass rod and wash bottle. Preparation of 0.1 molar perchloric acid standard solution. Dissolve 8.5 ml of 72% perchloric acid in about 900 ml of glacial acetic acid with constant stirring in a 1000 ml volumetric flask. Add about 30 ml of acetic anhydride and make up the volume to 1000 ml with glacial acetic acid and keep this titrant is allowed to stand for about 24 hours. Acetic anhydride absorbs all the water from perchloric acid and glacial acetic acid and renders the solution virtually anhydrous. Perchloric acid must be well diluted with glacial acetic acid before adding acetic anhydride because reaction between perchloric acid and acetic anhydride is explosive. Procedure for the standardization of 0.1 molar perchloric acid Standardization of the above prepared 0.1 molar perchloric acid with analytical reagent grade potassium hydrogen thalate. Weigh accurately about 0.521 grams of potassium hydrogen thalate on an analytical balance and dissolve in 50 ml of anhydrous acetic acid. This solution is titrated with 17.23 ml of the perchloric acid solution to the end point by adding a few drops of 5% weight by volume crystal violet in glacial acetic acid as indicator. At the end of the titration, the color of the solution changes from blue to bluish green. The exact molarity of the perchloric acid solution is calculated by taking 204.2 grams per mole as the molar mass of potassium hydrogen thalate and based on 1 is to 1 stoichiometry in the titration reaction. It is to note that 1 molar potassium hydrogen thalate is equal to 1 molar perchloric acid. Therefore, weight of potassium hydrogen thalate that is 0.3521 grams is divided by the molar mass of potassium hydrogen thalate that is 204.2 gram per mole which is equal to 1.724 into 10 to the power minus 3 moles. This number of moles corresponded to 17.23 ml which is equal to 0.01723 liters of perchloric acid titrant and the molarity of the titrant is calculated by taking 1.724 into 10 to the power minus 3 moles divided by 0.01723 liters is equal to 0.1001 moles. This is the list of references followed for the lesson. That's all in this video, the preparation and standardization of 0.1 molar perchloric acid. In the next lesson, we will learn the estimation of sodium benzoate and epidrine hydrochloride using non-aqueous titrimetric method. Till then, never stop learning and never stop watching my videos. Thank you for watching this video.